Thanks. Okay. <laughs> Here we are. So this morning I had something happen and I got a, a really powerful charge of information, right? Um, sort of like a trigger, but it was more of like this, um, like a lot of information came through after seeing an action that my husband took. So I wanna talk about this dynamic and how in relationships right now, what I'm noticing is that we are psychically maturing very, very quickly. We are able to decipher so much information from the energy that is behind actions that are being taken. This is incredibly empowering and it's actually always been this way. But what I've noticed is that, I've <laughs> got some little ones following me. What I've noticed is that women downplay this and it's coming back strong. We are, we are becoming fully empowered to read a room, to read a situation, to read an action and fully understand the story behind it, the real story, the core beliefs, the core energies that are behind actions. Okay, so I want to give this seemingly small moment that happened to me as an example, because in sharing this, what I want to do is empower you for when you're in these moments and it's usually you're by yourself, you're alone or with your children, right? You're not with like other wise women in the kitchen who can like absolutely confirm you, absolutely like be like, yes, sister, you are reading that correctly. I see it too. I see you. Yes. Yes to you, right? We don't, I don't have that in my kitchen. Okay. Who, like another woman who's just as psychic in tune. That's actually not true. Our caretaker Meredith has come into my life and she's like on point all the time. Okay. So if she was here, then that would be, that, I, 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 <laughs> if she was here, that would happen. Okay. But she wasn't today. So I'm in the kitchen, right? I'm in the kitchen. It's very early in the morning. Ben has already left for work. It's like 6 a.m. I'm, you know, getting just kind of getting, that's always the first place we go, right? We're in the kitchen. We're starting to get the day started, warming up the kitchen. I look in the oven. I see something. I'm like, what is that? So Ben, last night, had, and he's been taking over our meal plans. Bless him. He's been, our, our dinners, right? And I've been doing breakfast, lunches, snacks, bread, all of that but he's been fully taking on dinner and I saw that he took our our beautiful butternut squash cut it in half wrapped it in aluminum foil okay put that in the oven and baked it last night on like a cook timer so that this morning it would just be done ready to be made into soup for dinner tonight that's amazing however we do not use aluminum foil in my house so where did this come from why is it here I do not, ex I, that is a hard line for me. And my husband knows this. And yesterday or the day before, recently, very, very recently, I was looking at something I wanted to make. I realized I didn't have parchment paper. And, um, and I said to Ben, hey, I should, I should order some, yeah? Because we, we, there's some things that we need. And for whatever reason, it just didn't get done. So he, got aluminum foil okay so there are two equal perspectives on this situation okay i want to share them i'm <laughs> gonna share you'll be able to imagine which one is my perspective now before i do this i want to empower you to start to look to tend I've got this beautiful video coming out soon, the divine feminine call of tending. This is what we do, right? We're tending to our days. We're tending to our kitchens. We're tending to our children. We're tending to the food. All of what I just said, these are some of the most important, impactful things on our day-to-day -day life. So they are important and they deserve our attention. 
and they deserve to, whenever actions are taken, we can read the energy that was behind that action. You are empowered to do that and you are aware of these things. Now, this doesn't happen like all the time, but what happened to me this morning is that I saw that, I saw the butternut squash wrapped in aluminum foil, took it out of the oven and my heart sank. And I had that feeling in my body of understanding the story, the bigger story that then manifested in this seemingly small decision to use the aluminum foil around the butternut squash instead of just nothing at all was what I would have preferred, right? Okay, so when you get that charge, when you get that information, this is like spirit just tapping on the window, like, deet, deet, deet. hello, I just wanted to um, bring it to your attention that there is a whole packet of, of energy, of, of a story, of a core belief that, um, that is available for you to open up and for, for you to look at. And, uh, you know, so just, just going to leave that here, right? It's those, those little taps at the window are the ones I'm listening to now, because I know if I don't listen to the little tap on the window from spirit, a rock is going to come through you know, and then a tornado is going to come through and take the whole house down. And I don't have time for that. I don't have time to rebuild my whole house. I don't have time for that or replace a window, right? Okay. So when these, when you get those hits, no matter how it's delivered to you, when you see that there's, there is a core belief in your partner or someone in your family that is showing itself to you in a very seemingly small packet, do not ignore it. Do not ignore those moments anymore. This is a core wound that is, it is time for us to heal up. When it's, it's going to require grace, courage, some time to like, okay, let me, let me digest this and, um, and alchemize it into like a really uh, powerful conversation I can have with my partner. Give yourself that time to really articulate what it is that the energy is showing you. For some of you, that's gonna come through just like in that moment. You're just gonna be like, I see what's happening. Here it is. I'm spelling it out right now. Here's what's going on. And it's gonna be like lightning that comes through you. And then, and sometimes though, sometimes those moments, you get a charge, you get a feeling that like something is off. And here's what it is. Here's why these, th this, here it is. This is why it's so important. All of our habits, all of our habits are supporting us or not to our highest potential, okay? So there are some of you who are ready, like me, to get really micro with life. You are ready to like, you're not ignoring any more signs. Whatever life wants to serve you, it's like, yes, please, thank you, and more, right? But life life is going to continue to serve me that same story until i have the courage to change it and in a family dynamic that does that takes grace that takes articulation that takes thoughtfulness patience all of that it takes all of that okay so i'm running out of time here um i will take okay i'm gonna actually take this minute um, 30 seconds, whatever it is that I have and say, if, if the, if this content is helpful for you, I would love for you to tag a friend. Um, I'm really trying to get to that 10 K mark so that it's just easier for me to speak and to share and to, um, engage deeper. These are deep conversations, right? And so having that a little bit more time 
in this IGTV realm and being able to give you guys access to just swipe up and get right to the daily YouTube videos, that would all just be super helpful. So I really appreciate the sharing or tagging friends who um, are, are ready for this kind of empowerment and motherhood and family life. I love you guys so much. Thanks for being here. And I would love to see if this resonates with you. Um, and it was a super powerful moment for me today that I was just really looking forward to sharing with you.